actually thought that the Cowboys were going to win last night. <laughs> Tell the truth, Dallas Cowboys fans. Y'all nervous as hell, ain't y'all? Dallas Cowboys ain't going to the Super Bowl, y'all. All of this was set up by Jerry Jones. All of this was ordained and destined by Jerry Jones. Who could not shut the hell up? You did this to yourself, Jerry. You did this to yourself. You know good and damn well that Jerry Jones is prone to get in his own way. You know good and damn well that this man is allergic to prosperity and will find a way to mess up a good thing. Ladies and gentlemen, at the time, the Dallas Cowboys were 11-1 and without Romo. Dak Prescott had won 11 straight games. That's more than Hall of Famers Roger Starback or Torrey Aikman. More than Romo ever did. More than any quarterback in Dallas Cowboys history has ever done. And this man, Jerry Jones, who has not had a Super Bowl title in 22 years, is talking about Tony Romo instead of Dak Prescott. Do you see how this smells? Do you see how this looks? Not only did Jerry Jones do it to himself. <laughs> I personally love it. Don't bother me at all. <laughs> I told y'all. Jerry Jones would never let me down, did I not? And sure enough, it's happening before our very eyes. He's laying the foundation for Dak Prescott to get screwed over. For Tony Romo to get back up in there. Aaron Rodgers' life seems pretty damn good to me. Why? Because he's a bad man. Aaron Rodgers, living pretty well these days. Wish I could say the same for the Cowboys. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just had to get that in there.